asking a judge is actually about two things. One is something we can all learn, that is law. Uh, and the other half is about being a different human being, human being dedicated to justice and fairness to, to, to others. And I think what made uh, Babulanga outstanding generally is that he possessed those two qualities required for one to become a judge equally. And I think that's what made him an important figure in South African politics and in the South African legal fraternity. And what would you say uh, the judicial system, the legal fraternity, as you say, can learn from uh, just some of the causes that he undertook, the judgments that he made, and it, does he leave it the same? You know, I think the greatest lessons we must learn, I spent hours with, uh, with Chief Justice uh, Langa every day up until Saturday uh, before he died. And I think one learned at a personal level that he was a person who insisted on integrity in every sphere of his own life and therefore he took that to the profession and he was one of those lawyers that understood that law is simply not about money it's actually a profession about human beings and i think he lived that generation of lawyers uh, uh, Langa, Chaskalsin, and others lived the life that is required. And I think the great lessons to be learned by lawyers like myself and other jurists in the country is that all the country needs from people who stand in judgment of others is being decent human beings to be just and to have utmost and unquestionable integrity. The other side of the Chief Justice that I'm sure a lot of us were not privy to that really stood out for you, what would you say it is? You know, he was a humble human being who could walk in Sepis or anywhere and you wouldn't necessarily get the shivers that the, uh, the Chief Justice has walked in or a great judge mm -hmm. has walked in. He, there was something ordinary about him which made him a great human being that no way i i could go to see him anytime and when he he was not doing well i could sit with him and we would discuss mm. those things and when he had pain after the death of his wife i could sit for hours with him and i think what made him like what makes most human beings great is being human mm. is that chief justice pius langer was human had all those attributes you need to be a human being and i think you got that when you sat with him even when i sat with him on saturday so i went to see him in hospital for the last time and for the first time i had seen him three times when he was ill mm. he told me told me two things one he said mostly i'm very ill which is something he had never said before mm. and and then he told me that he was trying to eat and he couldn't and those are the two things he said and he he slept after that and so i think he's a man who acknowledged pain when he felt it and he was a man who interacted with others. Even me, I, he's my father, really. I've known him for a long time. And he interacted with me as an equal.